The Center for Climate Prediction has released its three-month outlook today for December, January, and February, updated with an even stronger inclination of warmer-than-average conditions for meteorological winter. That's a three-month period across the northwestern United States. We were expecting this with a developing El Nino, still a strong confidence uh, that that phenomenon will develop. It's still not quite there. We're in Enso neutral presently. Uh, Precipitation-wise, this is a little bit of a departure. Uh, El Nino always means warmer than average temperatures with almost no exclusions. Precipitation, it's a little bit of a different story. There's less of a certainty that we'll have drier than average conditions, but more often than not, we do have drier than average El Ninos. But uh, right now, they're showing a strong southern branch of the jet stream. Very good news uh, for California and the desert southwest. And no inclination toward drier than average conditions across the northwest. So that means we could still do real well for our ski season and have warmer than average conditions down in the valleys. Right now we have some wet weather across the region as a cold front is making its way across the area overnight. Pockets of freezing rain, a possibility. We should be dry by tomorrow morning in most locations. Some lingering showers down on the Palouse in the Elsie Valley tomorrow morning. And then a dry northerly flow sets up over the region heading into the weekend, which means some sunshine for the weekend and hopefully keeping the fog away so we can enjoy it. Uh, dry conditions for the most part right on through the seven-day forecast. Possibility of some mountain showers. Could have a sprinkle or two Tuesday night, but right now it looks like it's going to be great weather for Thanksgiving travel.